Hey, hey, you thought to mend our happy. We are yes, back. We are back. Yes, sir. And we have a special, special oh, something yes. for our mama, Reverend Kathy Wagoi Kuna. Wagoi? Wagoi Kuna. Kuna. Reverend. Reverend. Yeah, Reverend. It is your birthday, mama. It's your birthday, mama. Go, mama. It's, it's your, your birthday. birthday. We're going to party like it's, it's your, your birthday. Queen. We're going to read the Bible. Read like the Bible. It's like your, it's your birthday. birthday. For those who know that song. Mm. <laughs> hey, check yourself. Check yourself. Check yourself. Check yourself. <laughs> if you don't dance here, where do you dance? <laughs> where do you dance? <laughs> but it is our mama's birthday. And you know, our mother is... How do you even describe this woman? She is multifaceted. That's the word I was looking yes. for. A mother's love for her child is like nothing else in the world. It knows no law, no pity. It dares all things and crushes down remorselessly all that stand in its path. Mother love is the fuel that enables a normal human being to do the impossible. M is for the million things she gives us. O is for her objectivity in our situation. T is for the tears she sheds to save us. H is for her heart of purest gold. E is for her eyes with love and light shining. R means right and right shall always be. The strength of motherhood is indeed greater than natural laws. This is why her children rise up and call her blessed. Once upon a time there was a tree, and it's under this tree that greatness was brought into this world. That greatness had quite the life growing up. When she came out uh, from my womb, she did not cry. Okay. So the woman who was accompanying me to the hospital decided to ask for a car. Mm -hmm. Then the car came, we were taken to the hospital, we were admitted for three days with her. All that time she never cried. She never opened her eyes until uh, after a week. That is when she opened the eyes and she cried. Wow, yes. after one week. After one week. Her youth was full of adventure. Uh, we used to discipline our children by beating them, unfortunately. But uh, she never, even when she came home and I beat her. She was not bothered at all. She, she used to tell me, Mom, I'll do this until I'm tired. Even if you beat me, I won't give, I won't give up. We used to listen to careless whispers and we would cry till morning. I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna dance again. have known that this woman will become a matriarch of a great generation. To document her achievements is no mean feat. An accomplished musician with two albums to boot, a best-selling author with three books under her belt, an international worship leader, a loving wife and mother to three beautiful children, a great cook, a homemaker, a homekeeper. The list is endless. You know, Biology is the list of what makes someone a mother. At least that holds true for us, the Cunites. We have been incomparably blessed with a matriarch like no other. There is never a dull moment with her. I tell you, everywhere Pastor Kathy goes, there is joy. When we got married with my husband, in our honeymoon, woe unto the ones who are neighboring us. We never saw them because we never left the room we were praying. And many times when you're left hungry for too long, you pray for long. You'll get it, some of you, on your way out. 
So, and you'll say, ha, that's what mom meant. With her, we look like and carry ourselves around like queens. And how could we possibly not emulate her intrinsic sense of style? With her, we have an intercessor, a listening ear, a shoulder to cry on, a ready embrace whenever we need it. She instills in us such confidence, raises our esteem. Look at yourself in the mirror and say, come look at this face. Come even closer. Not bad, huh? You know why? Because you're not bad, huh? Why the Bible says that whoever finds a wife, finds a good thing and obtains favor before the Lord, where are the good things in JCC? Ah, that's what I'm talking about. Corrects us, rebukes us. We know we are loved because it shines in her eyes. The most captivating element, her smile, her warmth. Around her, you know for sure that everything will be just fine. What a woman. We are successful because she's been there, teaching, laboring in love, and enjoying every minute of it. Her greatest triumph? She's our dad's best friend, lover, protector, and nurturer of his dreams. I want you to know, baby, that I love you. I love you more than words can say. I love you with everything within me. I love you so much, baby, because you are the person that God gave to me to make sure that I get to my place of destiny. And you filled my life with joy. You filled my life with laughter. I am who I am today because of you standing by my side. And maybe it doesn't matter what you go through, ups and downs. I just want you to know that I will love you until I go to the grave. You're the best thing that God ever gave to me. I am proud of you. I am so blessed to have a wife like you. My honey. He is the butter in my bread, the honey in my tea. He makes my baby leap. He rocks my world, and he spins me over the place. I tell you, he is a bad brother boy, but I call him my own personal bad boy, but he's your bishop. Hi, baby. I just want to take this opportunity and wish you a very, very happy birthday. Honey, I just want to let you know that spending these 20-some years with you has been one of the most exciting journeys that I've ever been on. And I'm so grateful to God for allowing you to come into my life and allowing you to be part of my destiny. And today, I just want to wish you a very, very, very happy birthday and say that you're such a woman of integrity, such a woman of character, such a woman of honor. Indeed, you're the noble woman that the Bible talks about. Loving you has been easy, it's been a delight, it's been amazing. And anytime you're away from me, like these two weeks that you've been away, it's my, the most miserable time of my life because indeed we are supposed to be together all the time. I wish you a very happy birthday. I want you to enjoy yourself and to know that me as your husband, I am privileged and honored to have married such an incredible queen. I love you, my sweetie, and happy, happy birthday. Mwah. Happy birthday, my dear daughter. I wish you good birthday. May God give you days and more and more. And lead you to do what God, he created you to do. The way you are doing, leading your, your, your ministry into high levels. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Wave. Yeah. Yeah. On behalf of JCC Parklands Pastors, we love you. Happy birthday. Happy, Happy birthday. Hi, Mom. As you celebrate your birthday, we just want to tell you how happy we are to be connected with you. We just want you to, to know how much your life has enriched our lives. As uh, the resident pastor of JCC, Parklands, and my own behalf and on behalf of my family, happy, happy birthday. birthday. My mom, for every year of my life, you visibly won the best mother of the year award. No one even comes near your winning ways. I wish you a great birthday just as you are, Mom. Happy birthday. Hi, Mom. I want to take this opportunity to wish you a happiest, happiest birthday. Thank you for being such an inspiration. May God give you so many years to impact this generation. Love you. Mwah. Hi. Hi. Hi, Mom. Hi. 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 What's up? Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday. Yeah. Reverend Kathy Kuna. We yes. love you so much. Oh, hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. hallelujah. Happy birthday yeah. to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kathy. Happy birthday, dear Kathy. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kathy. Yeah, dear Kathy. Happy birthday, Pastor Kathy. I cannot wait to see you. This season is a new season for you. I can't wait to be at the Daughters of Zion. Hey, Chase CC, make sure you spoil mommy today. Uncle will pay the bill. See you soon. God bless. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, mom. We will love you and we pray for you. Thank you. Happy birthday, my dear mom. On behalf of my family and the entire JCC Nakuru, we wish you a great celebration. We love you and we thank God for you. You are such a true blessing. Happy birthday, mom. We love you. We celebrate you. You're the best mommy ever. And we just want to say thank you for your input into our lives. Birthday greetings from the Washira all the way from Nottingham, Nottingham UK. UK. We, we love, love you. you. Bye. Mwah. Hi, Mom. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. We love you so much. Thank you for being such an awesome mom. You're truly the best. And also, Mara in law. Thank you for being the best, best friend. Thank you for always being there for us, no matter what. And all the best to your birthday, all the above, and welcome to the teens. <laughs> love you. Love you. Love you. Bye bye. Bye. Hi, Mom. I just want to say happy birthday. Thank you for being the best mom ever. Thank you for um, always being there for me, and I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And um, thank you, because I can't really explain it. I'm a mom's boy, and I love you, mom, with all my heart. Tunataka kuiba kapambio ya bad day. Yes, na tunataka nyinyi audience. Yani we mwenye umeka kwa hiyo kiti hapo. Yes. Mutu join na tuibe. 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 Sing around. Sisi and do, don't don't <laughs> listen to the voice. Yes. Listen to the words. This is the message. <laughs> In, uh, yes. Yeah. <coughs> Happy birthday, dear. Dear my to. Happy birthday, dear my to. Dear mom. May you have. May you have. Many more. May you have. Many. Many, many, you have many, many. many, many. Na mam yes. kama mamu gesha muka utu joins ju kwa nini bado umeketi. Na kaba kuja kabadhi deni ketu. Yes. Kisi yongwa she. Kisi yongwa she. Kisi yongwa she. Wash ni keki keki. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reverend Kathy Wangoi Kuna, you made us hungry for revelation. You caused us to thirst for transformation, and we thank God for your inspiration and your overall demonstration. From the ministry to the marketplace, you have raised a standard among women. You've never been average. You've never been ordinary. You've never been caught in the middle of hypocrisy. You've never been confined to other people's opinion, even when they didn't agree. A preacher and a leader, a worship leader, a mother, a wife, a friend, a sister, and an author. With your patience and perseverance, your strength and your confidence, you have brought about a revolution in the society from NTV to citizen TV turning women to Jesus they say that you hated the poor and that you only preach prosperity and encourage women to marry rich guys that was only the criticism the controversy that you had to taste in order to become one of the most influential women in Kenya when they couldn't attack you they started to attack your family they still wondering how a preacher can host a show have the most power for women ministry in Africa and still connect with the great women have been liberated through women without limits and daughters of Zion I'm not just talking about physically but spiritually and mentally who would have known 
assume that a young girl would turn out to be a great inspiration and push women to accomplish their dreams? Who would have thought that her ministry will pull many to Christ and have children and sons and daughters all over the world, including your own Vanessa to Stephanie to Jeremy? And we cannot forget our bishop and our daddy. We honor you and we appreciate you and we thank God for you. We thank you for sharing Pastor Kathy with the world and for the price that you've had to pay. Reverend Kathy Kuna, we honor you, we celebrate you, and we thank God for you for giving us nothing but your best. I urge you and I challenge you to keep being unique and keep doing what you do and stay anointed because you turn this unbeliever of marriage to believe in marriages. I challenge you to keep doing what you do because you turn this lady who did not believe in herself, believe in herself. Reverend Kathy Kuna, finish the race, complete the work and get the job done. Finish the race, complete the work and get the job done. I wish you happy birthday. May God bless you. Your husband, the, the bishop, your family. And we wish you all the right from God. And uh, we look forward to see how you feed the nation. Is it any wonder that today we choose to honor and celebrate the matriarch of the Kuna generation? We love her for the simple reason that she is the living epitome of true love.